That's not how I start my show, Katie. I have a tagline. And now I have an outro. You're gonna love it. <sighs> this is the most boring suitcase I've ever seen. This is a look. This is my favorite sweater that you've seen probably like five times in the last two months. And this is Jess Paul. If you guys were upset that I did art all month, um, I'm sorry. If for all you that like my art stuff, you're welcome. Here's some more. I always wanted to paint this suitcase because it literally looks like every single suitcase I've ever seen come down the conveyor belt. In fact, I've almost picked up other people's suitcases. If somebody literally opened my suitcase, they'd be in for a world of the most useless things to everyone except for myself. I've often thought if I was on the bus and left my donut shells on the bus or someone like stole them from me, who else would need that? And who else would know what that is? Ow, 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 ow. Ow, ow, ow. I just, I just made the realization that if this turns out like really bad, I still have to take it with me and like be, have it shown all in public. At like least you'll know it's yours. <laughs> nice thinking thinking out positively, Katie. No matter what, it's still marked by you and you'll know that it's yours. Oh my god. It's so embarrassing. It's not like one of my jackets where I like can get a new jacket or anything. I have to take this one. It's the biggest suitcase we have. Well, don't screw it up, Jessica. And now I'm going to answer questions from you guys. Katie's gonna read them while I continue to paint this um scary disaster. I really hope this works out. Phil asks, what your favorite media to roth with? <laughs> to work with, I think. When painting, i.e. oil, watercolor, Got it. acrylic. I usually use acrylic base. I think that this is acrylic base, this kind of paint. It at least is a fast drying medium. Um, as you guys have learned, I do not do well with oil paint. <laughs> do you remember how Jesus Kitty used to look before? No. It was really ugly. I can't do anything that takes a long time to dry. I need it to be done fast or digital, which I can mess up and go as fast as I want. And uh, Apple Z, Apple Z, Apple Z. Anthony asks, which movies are you most excited for this year? So I don't know if you guys know this. You don't. I, I don't, don't watch movies. I don't watch movies. Oh. <laughs> that is what I was gonna say. Oh. Do you know? Did you know that? I know that you don't. I don't watch a lot of movies. I especially don't go to the theater because I is poor. I know that people, that some people, even if they're poor, would value a movie theater experience over other things, but I'm, um, I'm a doing person. Does that make any sense? Like, I love working and doing something, so to kind of be passive and sit back is, uh, it makes me really antsy. I do watch a lot of things. I watch a lot of YouTube, to be honest. I could probably tell you more of my favorite YouTubers, but you guys didn't ask that question, so. Um, but I also am also watching YouTubers always while I'm doing other things. Or if I, if I actually want to relax, if I genuinely don't want to be doing anything that's, that causes me to make money. <laughs> <laughs> Then I'm literally lying in bed and watching either Netflix or more YouTube, most likely YouTube. Sometimes, tell me if you do this, I'll, I'll listen to video podcasts while I watch them. Like, I want something so mind-numbing and conversational that I'll literally lie in bed and just watch a video podcast without doing anything else. Because when I relax, I want to relax. I do not want to go to the movie theater. But I guess I actually, so I might want to see cats. I want to see what's up with that. I at least want to see a little bit of it and see, uh, see what all the hubbub is about. And because I kind of know the, the play. So, uh, let's see what cats looks like. I don't know what other movies are coming out this year. Okay, Phil asks. Hey, Phil. When you're in your zone, do you stop to eat or drink? Um... I drink coffee like it's my job. But actually, um, when I when I'm doing donuts or if I'm like doing computer work, <laughs> spitting everywhere. If I'm doing computer work, <laughs> I literally will forget that I missed a meal until I'm 
ravaged and can't take it anymore. That I does happen. So tiny. I <laughs> just need so little anymore. I'm poor, but I'm also so skinny. I don't know how I do it. Jonah asks, <laughs> what got you into acting? We're gonna answer for, for 40 minutes. No, I actually already made an entire video about this, guys. It's Let me, me tell the story in my own words. Go ahead, Katie. It was fifth grade. <laughs> it was fifth grade. <laughs> <laughs> she was a cat. I- that's not- that's not my origin story. Well, Katie, when did you know you wanted to become an editor? Let me tell you. Oh my god, do you have that origin story? I do. Wish I had a camera for you. Do you want to sit over here with me or not? No. Okay, go ahead. My origin story is... In ninth grade, we had a class called Theater Arts. We had to make a project related to the crucible and we you know we gonna play some of that you know yeah. we are <laughs> oh my god i'm so excited we i can't play the audio because it's an actual song but i will promiscuous girl by nelly Furtado. it is a music video of you know comparing the crucible scenes to such you know song lyrics of that song anyway the teacher and the class loved it so much. Because it was amazing. I mean, I did- It was amazing, especially for your age, for the time, for the resources that we had, for your, for your like, skill experience. That's all well and good, but you also have to play the credits to where I typed them out <laughs> on everybody's still shots, printed it out scanned it back into the computer to get it into the software because I had no other way to do so. But the but the the trick was the the little setback was that the printer was running out of ink. <laughs> so therefore I ended up with these really streaky like still shots. No, I had no other way. But I was crafty, you know? We I always, thought, what other work We always can did I have? find some solutions when we couldn't figure out how to export a video onto any kind of disc or flash drive, we would film the screen mm -hmm. of the computer so that you could give anybody epilepsy even if they didn't start out with the disease. So that was when I decided I wanted to be an editor because it got such great response and I thought, well, I like this feeling, I'm good at this, or so I thought. And that was the start of it. Do you still like editing, Katie? Of course I do. But do you really? Yes! <laughs> I hate to start editing my stuff because it's I- It's because you do it so wrong. You do, <laughs> you do it in motion. I really That's do. That's not an editing software. Actually, people do ask me, and they don't- And I always want them to say, like, why they ask me, because uh -oh. they're other, um, filmmakers of sorts, you know? They see my yeah. reel, uh -huh. and then I say, I, I did my- I edited my reel, and then they go, what software did you use? And I'm like, I always want to be like, why are you asking? Is it because it's so good and oh, innovative oh. or because it's so bad? So I exported my video yesterday and I start watching it and uh, the way that motion, you, you use motion, right? No. At all? No. Okay. You do it in layers, like, like, a fo like Photoshop layers and everything, you know? And you can turn a layer off, you can turn a layer on. Mm -hmm. I exported it, started watching it after it was done, and immediately saw that one of my layers uh, wasn't there at all. Which I go one? The one on top of the first one. Well, what was on that layer? I ca so the secondary layers, I call them floats. Like, I, I label them <laughs> floats, because... <laughs> what? I'm just, like, making up stuff. <laughs> I am! I'm making up my own language, because it's floating. Stuff is floating on top of my, my cut. Like my, my... They're called tracks. Track one, track two. You're so that makes track. sense too. <laughs> we all float down here though. The third layer was called floats on floats. <laughs> Do you tell this to people? I've never told this to anyone. Oh my god, please don't. Please keep it to yourself. Rachel. <laughs> I'm telling her. No, I'm literally telling my entire office. Floats on floats. So, um, oh my god. Like, I can show you, I'm not making this up. And so, um, I'm watching it, and floats on floats was there. <laughs> floats wasn't, though. Floats are, um, like, the, the pictures and the graphics that pop yeah. up and pop out and everything. So the graphics layer. Yeah. And then the floats on floats is, like, text. 
text or like an arrow. Like there was an arrow pointing to something else that was pointing to another float. Okay. And that float wasn't there, so the arrow wasn't pointing to anything. At least you keep it organized. I had the program up. All I had to do was was Apple Z if I deleted it somehow. I Apple Z'd all the way to the bank and like don't know where it disappeared. I don't know how that's possible because I was editing the thing. Like, it was just back, backtracking to it without, as if the floats never existed. Floats and floats and floats. Four more hours. I think what I'm going to do, this will be a work in progress, because it has to be. Because <laughs> I wanted to do a sky, and I wanted to do roots on the bottom, because I wanted to do the back, too. Because sometimes when they're on the conveyor belt, yeah. they flip over. Like everything that I do... I realize something's gonna take much longer and is much harder than I thought it was going to be. So, I'm going to try to make a pretty cool design, but it's not going to be my full design. Story of my life. Oh. I don't know. Don't know. Actually, that's on. Oh, that's a. That's a stink bug. <gasps> But I have to I have to admit something that's been like that the whole time. What? I never bug? noticed that it was a stink bug until now. Like when? Like right now. No, when did you notice? Like since it? I got home. Oh. Like since I got so home is it dead? from Los Angeles. Guy guys. I thought that the tip of my uh my mannequin's nose was off as well. Um and this whole time it was a bug. It was a bug. This whole time meaning Meaning since I got home from Los Angeles. Two, three weeks ago. Yeah, it's really dead. It is? It's gotta be. I think it, like, is becoming part of the mannequin. Wanna get a look at it, Katie? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> it's little tentacles are like... It's stuck. You have to pry them off. Oh, it's so crunchy! He's really dead. All of his legs fell off. Oh my god. I'm really glad my mannequin's okay, though. Kind of looks like, uh, like, kind of looks like, like, the, um, the old-fashioned, um, like, speakers. Oh, sure. Well, yeah, it's like hip-hop. Or a horn. But really messily done. <laughs> it's like hip-hop. <laughs> kind of be like hip-hop. <laughs> so that's what I'm that's what I'm going to Chicago with. That is definitely not what I she decided to paint Chicago on the suitcase. <laughs> it's I have no idea what city that is. I'd be nervous to live in that city, to be honest. But I'm that's what we got. I'm gonna live right there. <laughs> I'll put a little light in the window, Katie. Okay. <laughs> Katie's home.